Welcome to this final video about simplifying expressions, yeah? And I can't, I can't emphasize enough how important it is that you are familiar with this concept of simplifying expressions, yeah? Where we've said to simplify an expression that means combining the like terms, yeah? And the sign in a particular expression belongs to the term directly after it. And we also said that the combination of letters is important. Okay, so I have four final uh, example questions basically showing all of this, uh, all of what I've just said. Okay, let's have a go. 5x squared plus y squared minus 3x, did I say x squared? Again, sorry guys. 5x squared plus y squared minus 3x squared plus x, okay? And I have to simplify the expression. So I have to find the like terms. So this is a term with the variable x squared, okay? Do I have another term with the variable x squared? And indeed, over there. So I'm gonna put a box around 5x squared minus 3x squared, yeah? Not plus, no, the plus belongs to the y squared, yeah? It's minus 3x squared. What about that x? Are they like terms? No, they're not because their combination isn't the same if you like, yeah? Because this is x and this is xx and this is also xx, yeah? x squared, meaning x times x. Okay, so that x is not a like term. They are unlike with uh, compared to the x squared. So if I have to simplify that, 5x squared minus 3x squared. So that will be 2x squared. And then I have another y squared left and I have another x left, yeah? Please note that you can do this in any combination. You could also say y x squared plus x plus 2x squared, yeah? whatever. Okay, the next question, abc plus abc, two terms and I have to simplify it. Is the combination of letters the same? abc, abc, yes it is. What is the coefficient here? Well, it's a one if you like, yeah? one abc. Excuse me, one ABC. How many ABCs do I have here? Yeah, another one. So what is my answer if I simplify it? It's gonna be two ABC. All right, moving on, question C. 5T plus T squared minus 6T. Yeah, simplify the expression, meaning combine the like terms, terms with the same combination of variables. T and T squared are unlike. I need another term with a t, which I have over there. Yeah, so if I box it, I have 5t. Take away 6t, yeah? The positive again belongs to the t squared. 5t, take away 6t, that will be minus t. And then I have another t squared. And they are unlike because this combination is not the same. That is a t and that is a tt, yeah? t to the power two. So the power also has to be the same for them to be like terms. Of course, Perhaps some of you said, well, that's t squared minus t. That is exactly the same. Last but not least, question D, 7x minus x squared plus xy. Do I have any like terms? Well, I have an x here, but that is an x squared, so xx, so those are not like terms, and that is xy. And I don't have any other term with xy either, so, I can't simplify this expression any further. That is already the simplest form. Fantastic, hopefully that was useful, okay? Like this video and share it if it was. And you can find me on my site, explainingmaths.com, uh, and you can ask me your question. You will find more free resources, and uh, yeah, I hope to see you there one day. See you later, bye-bye.